What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Pizza Maker 8000. Now, today I'm gonna have a little discussion with you guys. You know, the discussion and the topic of this video is gonna be Do you need max gags? Period. Do you know, question why that's the end of the question. You know, and there's different ways to look at it. You know, do you need max gags for a VP, for a CEO, to, you know, to do a building, to go to this part of you know, whatever it may be? And my personal opinion is, you know, max gags is the most important thing in the game, and that's my opinion. I'm gonna go ahead and explain why. The reason I'm saying that is because, you know, everybody always thinks that they can just progress with the game without doing like you know the full part man people like to like to run without putting their shoes on you know they like to skip ahead and do stuff in other ways like as you can see right here uh won't even let me show you but this one of the tunes that i'm running with you know was a 93 laugh 92 laugh something like that it has all level seven of their gags maxed another person I'm running with is 115 laugh or 116 laugh one of the two and they only have um not all of their gags are level seven. They have two level six gags, and you know I'm not necessarily not going to bring somebody because of that that reason. But you know when it's a smaller tune and it's you know not raised up on such a high scale, when you have a tune that's uh, 60 laugh, which I run into this problem a lot. I have a tune that's 60 laugh, and they'll come in and they'll have you know just a trunk, and they'll be trying to do a VP, and I'm like you know I, I personally do not want to run with a tune that only has a trunk in a VP due to the fact of you know not necessarily that they're too that it's not enough you know. But you only can carry three trunks. Three trunks is not going to last you long. You know, if even if you don't have your foghorn maxed, if you just have, you know, a level six gag, that means you can carry seven trunks rather than only carrying three trunks. And it makes a very big difference within the gameplay. Even though it's a VP and it's easy, it still harms the rest of the team, man. And I think it's selfish for you and for anybody else to want to bring somebody that does not have the gags or the requirements of gags to a certain extent to bring them in a the game just to make them feel better, just to, you know, let them get in on um, the VP when you should, you know, tell them up front, yo, go get your, go get your foghorn, don't come in here without the, without a level six gag, you know, people start, to, you know, people get butt hurt and they get mad and they bitch and complain and they moan and all this shit, instead of actually listening to what you're saying, man, and that's, that's the big problem with this game, man, is like, there's a lot of people on here that are super sensitive and they don't listen to logic, if you tell them one thing, you know, they just see it as you being rude and not necessarily seeing what you're saying, they just want to progress through the game and get through it, the fastest way without actually going through and working on their gags and gags are the most important thing man my personal opinion is you should not be in a vp if you do not have a level six gag if you do not have level six sound you should not be in a vp and if your sound list of course is different but if you have sound and you don't have level six sound you should not be in a vp and then of course for cj or i mean a, C, a cfo you better have a level seven foghorn coming in there unless your sound list, of course and you know it's just, it's just steps to it man but people always, especially with the VP, man, the VP, I like to do a lot because I like to help the smaller tunes. But, you know, the biggest problem I run into is, you know, people that are small tunes always try to come in with low gags and then expect big tunes that worked on their gags and actually put in the work in the game to go ahead and carry them through the game instead of actually going to working on their gags and being able to carry other people or not having to be carried at all, just being able to play like on a normal basis like everybody else is. But instead of that, they don't want to work on their gags. They want to come in here and expect people to carry them. And then they want to train in the VP, but, you know, that's another discussion for another time, man. But that's that's my biggest problem is, man, I think that your gags need to be maxed. Maxing your gags should be your number one priority. You shouldn't be doing a VP. shouldn't be doing a factory. You shouldn't be none of that. You should be going to buildings, training your gags with some friends, and doing whatever you need to do in order to achieve that. So, you know, that's my personal opinion. Okay, what are these guys picking, man? Fucking sound. Like, oh, come on, man. Okay. But well, that's my personal opinion. As you can see, we have a 62 with this. But look, there, her gags are maxed. And that, that should be... I have no problem. I don't care if you laugh. I don't have no problem. Unless you're an Uber, man. I do have a problem with Ubers because it is very, very... It puts everybody else in a predicament. I made a video. Um, I'll put the link to it in the bio. But I made a video when I had uh, Uber with me. And, you know, the Uber went down. Uber had 25 laughs. So, you know, I couldn't heal them. We were at the scale cog round in a VP. And I could not heal them because... One, I'm tuneless, but I wouldn't even have the chance to if I wasn't tuneless because we got hit back to back to back with a power trip and they ended up going sad on the second power trip. Nobody could save them. They end up going sad. And it's like, you know, I, you shouldn't be in here because you put everybody in predicament. You know, you want to have fun. You want to, you know, whatever the case may be on why you make an Uber, that's your personal opinion. But, you know, you're only hurting the team. And that's how I feel. So when I don't want to bring Ubers, people get offended instead of, like I said earlier, instead of listening to what I'm saying and listening to the reasoning why I don't want to bring you as an Uber because you're going to put the, the team at risk, even if, it's a v, even if it's a VP and it's easy and it's not that hard compared to, you know, doing a CEO, <coughs> excuse me, doing a CEO, whatever the case may be, 
But people, like I said, people don't listen to, to reason at all in this game. And that's another reason why I think a lot of people that are big YouTubers on this game have quit. If you go ahead and watch, you know, Master Frizzy Dog and Pop and DJ CY, that's his real name, DJ CY12345 or something like that. If you go ahead and watch some of his videos, man, he'll explain. He kind of says the same thing I do. And I'm just kind of, you know, emphasizing what he says. I'm not necessarily... This is he didn't make a video on this topic, but you know this is something I think needs to be addressed, and I think that people just need to, you know, max their goddamn gags before they come into VP or come into anything boss battle related. But that is it for this video. Be sure to comment, like, rate, and subscribe. It's your boy Pizza Maker Eight Thousand.